16 huge Hollyoaks spoilers for next week. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Next week on Hollyoaks, things are heating up with some jaw-dropping moments you won't believe. John Paul and Kitty find themselves in serious danger, Robbie Roscoe makes a shock return, and Leela and Joel's wedding hits some major obstacles. We've got all the biggest spoilers coming your way for the week of May 2024. Trust me, you won't want to miss a second of this drama-packed week. But before we dive in, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that bell icon so you never miss an update on your favorite soap. Let's get started. Here's a roundup of all the biggest moments coming up. Celia 1, John Paul is in grave danger. John Paul's in serious trouble as Carter holds him captive. It's a tense moment at the lake as John Paul desperately pleads for his life, his voice shaking with fear. Carter, however, seems unhinged and unmoved by John Paul's pleas. He looks at John Paul with a chilling calmness and tells him he's going to baptize him. The terror in John Paul's eyes is palpable as Carter's words sink in. You can feel the dread building up, knowing something terrible is about to happen. Without any hesitation, Carter drags John Paul towards the water. John Paul struggles, but Carter's grip is firm and determined. The lake's cold, dark water seems even more menacing as Carter forces John Paul closer. It's a heart-stopping scene as you watch John Paul's fear intensify, realising the gravity of what's coming. This moment is a stark reminder of the danger lurking in Hollyoaks, leaving us all on edge, wondering what's going to happen next. 2. Kitty is trapped, Beau confides in Sally, sharing his growing concern about Kitty, who's been missing for two weeks. Diane's been trying to contact her too, but with no luck. Both of them are worried sick and decide it's time to go to the police. Meanwhile, it turns out that Declan has been keeping Kitty locked up in a room by the lake all this time. The situation is getting more intense, as they realise the danger Kitty might be in, and the clock is ticking for them to find her. 3. Dylan and Lucas get closer. After their kiss, Dylan and Lucas start to feel more at ease around each other. They begin to share more moments, growing closer every day. Dylan understands Lucas's need for privacy and promises to keep their relationship under wraps until Lucas feels ready to go public. This promise strengthens their bond, as Lucas feels supported and understood. Their relationship is blossoming quietly, away from prying eyes, allowing them to enjoy their connection at their own pace. 4. Freya finds out the truth Freya is feeling really down, feeling left out by Dylan and Lucas, and she's also really shaken up by some abusive texts she's been getting. Leah, who's been watching all of this unfold, finally admits to Freya that she was the one who sent those nasty messages. Freya is hurt, and even more isolated now. Later, Scott steps in, trying his best to comfort Freya. He can see how alone she feels and just wants to help her through this tough time. 5. Cindy looks for answers Dave tells Cindy to stop asking about Lizzie's baby, but she doesn't listen to her husband and meets up with the support worker who was there when Lizzie gave birth. Dave claims he has been seeing his sobriety sponsor and tells Cindy it is due to the stress she has from putting on him while looking for Lizzie's baby. Cindy says she has given up, but she is lying and he later brings in Maxine to help search for Lizzie's daughter. 6. Bo tries to rescue Kitty At the cabin, Kitty pleads with her father who misgenders her and refuses to let her go. Bo shows Sally and John Paul a photo of Kitty, and he recognises the location, having been held there himself previously. Bo finds Kitty tied up at the cabin, and Chesity, and Sadity Tan, and she tells him that her dad has taken her. As Kitty is injured, Bo goes to get the car, but Declan finds him and knocks him out, while a petrified Kitty screams for help. 7. The village remembers Lizzie Dave is upset that Lizzie's funeral will take place in London with her family. So, to allow him to pay his respects, Cindy organises a memorial for Dave and Lizzie's friends, Ethan, Prince, Maxine, Tom and Perry. Dave is consumed by grief and bullies Cindy. Ethan tries to talk sense into him. 8. Hannah tries to help Suzanne. When Suzanne gets thrown out of the B&B, Tom offers her some advice. Hannah wants to help her mum, but knows her escort work means she can't, at price slice. Hannah tries to persuade Pearl and Zoe to take Suzanne in, but they are hesitant. Hannah pulls on Pearl and Zoe's heartstrings, and as they could do with some extra financial help, they agree, though they may regret their decision. 9. Arlo and Marie's relationship is strained. Arlo is really annoyed with Marie for constantly criticising his behaviour. Sensing the tension, Abe steps in to try and help them bond. His efforts pay off and Marie starts to appreciate his attempts, 
which puts him back in her good books. Feeling confident, Abe uses the same charm at the hospital with Cleo, and it works wonders as they decide to give their relationship another shot, and however, things take a turn when Abe lets Arlo down during a trip they had planned. Arlo feels deeply disappointed and hurt by Abe's failure to follow through. This setback leaves Arlo even more upset with Marie, to the point where he doesn't want to see her anymore, feeling more isolated and frustrated than ever. 10. Robbie Roscoe returns. Hannah gets ready for her next client, Dave, who ends up pouring his heart out to her instead. Dave leaves his wallet behind, and Hannah takes it. He later calls Hannah to say she is the only person he can talk to. A knock on the door reveals Hannah's next visitor is none other than Robbie Roscoe. 11. Leela and Joel's secret is revealed Leela and Joel's impending nuptials remain a secret, but they feel cramped by Marie. The plan is to invite their friends to a lunch that turns out to be a surprise wedding, and Liberty and Joel have worked on a surprise song for the occasion. Over a manicure, Marie gets Liberty to reveal that Joel and Leela are planning a wedding. 12. Marie and Leela fall out. Marie and Leela have a heated argument over the secret wedding, which escalates quickly. The tension reaches its peak when Leela slaps Marie and then throws her out. Amid the chaos, Leela finds an unexpected confidant in Cleo, who offers her support. Meanwhile, Liberty is feeling guilty and blames herself for the mess, just as the big day approaches. 13. Dave gets into a sticky situation Dave continues to berate Cindy, while Tony attempts to help save their marriage. Meanwhile, Dave threatens Hannah to return his wallet. Cindy and Hannah have an awkward reunion in the dog, and Dave promises Hannah the money if she keeps quiet about their meeting. Has Dave met his match? Later, Dave buys Cindy a gift and she is pleased when he promises her a holiday away. 14. Leela and Joel's wedding is in doubt. It's Joel and Leela's wedding day, but things start off on a shaky note. Joel wakes up hungover at the dog after a last-minute stag do with Marie and Abe, leaving Leela in a state of panic. She's worried sick, unsure if the wedding is still on, or if Joel might back out. The uncertainty gnaws at her casting a shadow over what's supposed to be the happiest day of her life. Meanwhile, Cleo spots Joel on the city walls, looking worse for wear. They have a quick chat, and Abe, who's been keeping an eye on things, notices them. Marie also catches a glimpse of their conversation and starts to feel suspicious. The tension is high as everyone wonders what's really going on and if Joel will make it to the altar on time. 15. Marie has a bombshell at the McQueen's, Marie confides in Abe, expressing her doubts about Leela being the right match for Joel. She's convinced that Joel deserves better and tries to persuade Abe to see things her way. Despite her concerns, Abe decides to keep his opinions to himself, not wanting to stir up more trouble on such an important day. As guests start arriving at the dog, Joel and Leela finally find a moment to reconcile. Their heartfelt conversation eases the tension, and it seems like the wedding is back on track. Just as everything is set to go ahead, Marie arrives, bringing fresh drama with her. She's determined to throw a spanner in the works, and her unexpected entrance threatens to derail the entire wedding once again. 16. Stee pleads with Warren, revealing that he needs to go to Amsterdam before his sentencing. Stay, feeling the weight of the impending court case, decides to make the most of the time he has left. He musters up the courage to ask Warren for a day with his children, hoping to create some precious memories before things potentially take a turn for the worse. It's a poignant moment as Steve faces the reality of his situation and tries to hold on to the things that matter most to him. Understanding the gravity of Steve's request, Warren agrees to let him spend a day with his children. Despite their complicated history, Warren recognises the importance of family, especially during challenging times. As Steve prepares to make the most of his time with his children, there's a sense of bittersweetness in the air, knowing that their time together is limited. Yet, in the midst of uncertainty, Stay is determined to cherish every moment and hold on to the love and support of his family.